I need to go spare this other guy. Time to spare you. There you go. Alright, you're spared. You are now spared. Welcome back, friends. Lost Guy here, and it's time to do another Metro Exodus. So, some things. One is... Usually you're able to kind of get through the entire game kind of pacifisty, right? Like, in one and two, right? And just sneak through. In this one... Those guys were going to die either way. Like, it, whether I murdered them or not, that train explosion killed them all. That's what was going to happen there. Other one, that guy who jumped the train, did this train run him over? I'm curious about that. But I'm enjoying the game. Let's get going. We are at a crossroads, so to speak, where everybody can help but wonder, what next? Where do we go from here? Hmm, yes. More or less what I expected from you. But you got the picture. So, is your counter functioning? Have you checked it? Yes, it's all green. Double checked it. Stepan's in the green too. We don't need masks here. So, they were telling the truth. Who was telling the truth? Why won't you answer? Who were those people trying to kill us? Why would they shoot at you, the Order's commander? Explain something at least! You owe us that! Well, I might as well drop the bomb now. <laughs> the war did not end. What do you uh, mean, what? did not end? Let me finish. Most of our cities are destroyed. The rest of the country is probably under enemy occupation. To avoid new nuclear attacks against us, command chose the only viable course of action. To play dead. To ensure radio silence, the shield system was created. A network of radio jammers covering Moscow and suburbs so that some radio enthusiasts wouldn't bring more bombs down on our heads by whining on air. And it's one of these jammers that got disabled by the hands of those present here. Could you not have shared that before? Say, uh, before Artyom took that radio outside and caught all that radiation? No! I only got briefed half a year ago under a strict to talk to die policy. And then had to tell my people we were securing a weather station. Sir, with all due respect, if we can't go back, maybe we should advance and move on? I have an idea, but... Uh, Artyom, rather than carrying on with this silent disapproval of yours, check silent. the airwaves. We should be out of the jamming range by now, so give it your best try. Look for transmissions from the Ark. Do you understand now why we are traitors in the eyes of command? We shut down a jamming station, shot up the guards, destroyed a patrol train, and ran away from Moscow. Who even needs a trial when the case is so clear? There's no way back now. Which means we have to continue moving forward. Command, what are you talking about? The Moscow Defense Command. Have you ever heard of the Invisible Watchers? I have, but they're just an urban legend. Our team keeps running into them. Not at all. They are command. What? Are you sure they care for me? Wait a moment. Oh. Don't interrupt them. Listen, everyone. I interrupted Storm. I hate that. So it is somewhere one, around here, the Yamantau Mountain. Area so one, the roof from eight, here should go five, uh, only by like this. This is our so goal. So is this what you had in mind? Yes, this is it. The Ark Project is a whole city underground. Enormous stores, machines, the best experts. It is the Commander General's HQ. All of the country's leaders are there. They have already started the restoration work. We will tell them that Moscow is alive. It wasn't all for nothing. Everything will change. Everything. Do you get it? A new life is starting for all the survivors. That place is going to be destroyed. By the way, are there any single women in that place? That place is going to be dead. <laughs> Great reaction. So I think the moment calls for 
Bring it out to me. Bring what out, Colonel? Sir, that thing that's been sloshing about in your canteen. <laughs> Do you think I'm deaf or what? Ah, that. Just a moment. I thought my ears were deceiving me. <laughs> <laughs> It's not a short trip to the Urals, so we should make ourselves comfortable, I guess. Well, let's name this bucket of bolts at the very least, huh? It's about time. Let's call our Anna and be done with it. <laughs> nah, go to hell! <laughs> Even better. <laughs> oh, come How on! How about Aurora, the Roman goddess of dawn and a cruiser of, uh, uh, you know what? That's better. <laughs> Not bad. I like it. Ah, beautiful name! Sounds okay, but the cruiser of what? Yeah, I'll tell you later. Looks like it's decided. <laughs> Let's trick to the Hey, Artyom, let's take a look at that map. All right, we had a round. That should be enough. Yermak, full steam ahead. Hi. Full, full steam ahead. ahead. We wow, that's yeah, some I distance. I wonder how long it will take. I swear to God, if it's 2035, I swear to God. If it's that many miles or kilometers. Turns out our team smokes. What's done is done. Yes, I didn't stop you from going outside. Yes, I tried to talk you out of it. Yes, I didn't tell you you are not the only ones to survive. But even I didn't have the clearance. I'm not back then. This is a state secret. Do you understand? I've been granted clearance only after a fight to protect the D6. They said they needed me to teach their recruits because the war was still on. Don't you think I was shocked? What did our people in D6 die for? What did I lose my legs for? But I understood. Because the war was still on. Security was paramount. Our people would have understood. So please, do the same. He would have spilled the beans to everyone in Metro. Yep. Caracalca, Prometheus, and mm -hmm. Sire. You must lead the people out of the caves. Do you think you would have saved anyone? Remember that jammer? What if Moscow has been found out because of you? What if there are missiles inbound? Anyways, no matter what they think of me, I know deserter and will never become one. I'm ready to bear full responsibility for everything. But if there is even the smallest chance to earn my pardon, I will take it. Which means that we, like a runner that tripped, need to keep running ever faster just to keep balance. And don't dare you trip us all over again. Am I understood? By the way, he's I calling the watcher's yeah. command? Anyway, at least now we know where to run. So, go back inside and take a look at the map. Our route is pretty obvious now. What smoking can this guy do? This is a really long lasting smoke. Alright. Andre Ivanovich, how long have you been working? Look, Artyom, you should at yeah. least get some of that fresh air. No mask. This is what you've always dreamed about. Okay. This guy's getting fresh air. Can you feel how sweet the air is without a mask? Or not just sweet, so many shades of taste it has. A weird feeling, I am a friend. Mm. I remember you telling me how you took your mask off atop a stunken otar. When you honed those missiles in on the dark ones. Yeah, the dark ones, okay. Was the air bitter then? Who knows though? 
Had you not launched those missiles, you'd probably never have climbed that building or received that signal. That was an one. Life is weird. Huh? One random event drags another with it, like links in a chain. And you are pulling that chain out of a deep, dark well. The links emerge from the dark water. And what drink is in that bucket that's on the end of the chain? That's a mystery. That's what I often think about when facing a choice. You can't drop the chain either. You always have to drink from that bucket. Well, bottoms up, I suppose. Okay. So, how does it feel to be the Moses who yanked on this particular chain? <laughs> Is it dumb to think about such things when all I ever did in life was carry out orders? Well, I'm not called idiot for nothing. Still, I would like to know what's on the end of your chain. Uh, only Anna gets to know that part, buddy. <laughs> Alright, moving on. Oh, that's why! He's an American! Why? We're just a short way from the city. I was like, why Steve Blue? Things might have been that easy in your America, but life has never been so easy here. How did he get here? Even now, we woke up saviors of the metro, and by lunchtime, we're enemy spies, saboteurs, train thieves, and what for? Something we thought was true turned out to be a lie. And that is enough for them to want us dead. The Hansa bosses must have known that we could live up here. But the public didn't know that. Who'd want to stay down in the metro if we told them? We cannot tell them. If they are ready to make men's meat out of old ladies and kids to keep their secret, what do you think would they do to you, Uncle Sam? Huh? We can't go back. We can't use radio. Remember the jammers? Even if you pull a perfect rumbo and break through back into the metro, do you expect they all just believe you and go, Yes, Moses, lead us out of this Egypt? Can you even imagine the death toll? Take your average station workers. Even if the Hansa guards didn't shoot them, how far would they get? Right to the nearest mutant den, most likely. We are safe here, speeding along on this Eastern Express. They are not as lucky. Not at all. What if there was a proper evacuation? <laughs> and who would do that? Hans's people? The ones that kept us under lock and key for 20 years? Well, or us too? Besides, getting the people out of Moscow is not the end of it. You have to settle them somewhere. Provide Is that the smoke on his facial hair? No, brother. I do get where you're coming from. But this matter is way more complex than it seems. I guess you're right. All this clean air went to my head. Huh? So, what does this mean? The colonel was in the know? His rank does seem to suggest that. Besides, he led negotiations with Hansa. Where would we be without them after the D6 debacle? They give us weapons, recruits to replenish our losses. We, on the other hand, our competence does not stretch beyond thinking cozy thoughts and keeping the fools in the metro from killing each other off. Remember, if not us, then who? You are too smart for your own good, idiots. <laughs> Alright. How far are we going to go? 2035. No masks needed. The railroad runs through the whole country. Hmm. As far as we want, I reckon. As for Yamantau, it's about 2,000 clicks away. 2,000? It certainly is a cold guzzler this time. Alright, yeah, coal stair stores, yep. That's what's going on, we gotta find coal things. Come back in, everyone's dead. I'm out of here, I guess. At first they got me to sign up by singing of my experience. They've been talking. People told me about weather stations and mutant migration observers. Blue stuff. Oh, an envelope. Shield Project Railroad Department, alright. Now has a goal to strive for because of you. Yep. 
We all remember the way you fought back in D6. So no matter what lies ahead, we're with you. You can count on us. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Yes, for me. I'm running a little inventory check. Yeah. It is kind of cramped in here. I'm thinking of making something of a workbench. Woo! So that's all the instruments we get, and everything else would be within arm's reach. With no workbench, you just lose small components. We'll use this place to work on the weapons, cleaning, oiling, keep out of everybody's way. So this will be our market sort of. With my stuff. All right. Uh, well, we'll have to take turns, of course, but we'll manage. So the train's going to be the source of all. So it's going to be our hub. Okay. <laughs> uh, well, hello there. Oh, Jones. Duke's doing it. You people could have called me up there to drink to Aurora. I still think Bill's Bob was a better name. <laughs> uh, well, help yourself. I'm working on the railroad. Live long day. You forget it's the winter. If only you didn't have to pay for this comfort later with your whole body aching. I've heard that monotonous labor calms you. Well, it's not a lie. I do feel this calm, you see. He do what says it's a dynamic meditation. That philosopher doesn't come here to meditate too often, though. <laughs> I guess it's good on the call. That's all? Okay, I'll take it from here. Oh, well, 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 well you want me to do more? Damn, bro. Okay, okay, I'll do more. Damn. Yeah, I didn't realize. I didn't realize. Thanks, man. Jeez, I don't know. <sighs> I do like 20. Do 20. One, two, three. Okay, let's take a bit. Okay, so my, I, I'm assuming, yeah, of course the 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 train is gonna be our hub where we're gonna do our weapon stuff, our storage, and all that stuff. So the, yeah, yeah, it makes perfect sense. So we're gonna be picking our next locations from here. I'm guessing the chapter is gonna be each progressive step, uh, just station as we go, and yeah, once we hit about. 2,000 kilometers uh, will be it's gonna be 2035 that's that's what it's gonna be at the end of this whole thing how funny oh my god well you could see it coming actually after all when you think about it so yeah where we have 15 right now we're at 15 there we go so all right 16 17 so we'll just we'll get going back to the map and do things we got enough story for the time being I'm sure there's a lot more we can listen to but that should be it 20 and you're 21, 21, 21. Blackjack. Thanks. The break sure was welcome. There we go. I'm a good buddy. Right, let's go do this. Do the map. I was proud to be helping those. Then, about two months ago, they loaded a bunch of people onto my Aurora. The guards took. Huh. Interesting. After all those years in the underground, the air of the surface seemed incredibly fresh, intoxicating. But that was not what had caused the crew's euphoria. Our journey finally got a definite purpose provided by the transmission from the government bunker in the Urals. For 20 years, we thought that neither the government nor military high command had survived. Turns out they're still around. Where were they while we were eating each other alive in the metro? We'll have a lot of questions for them once we reach Yamantau, if we reach it. The ruins of our country are under enemy control, according to Miller, and we'll have to fight through to our goal. A small team against the occupation armies? What are the chances that we'll succeed, that we'll get some answers?
I assume Yemen Tao is uh, just destroyed. I assume it's dead. That's my assumption. Here we go. The Volga. Yep, 776. Froze anything off yet, darling? <laughs> Here, let's warm you up a little bit. So, what do you think our chances of getting to Yamantau alive are? It's the only thing on my father's mind. How to earn his forgiveness, get back to Metro and his old life. The life you had always been running from. And to think, I never believed you. And now I'm looking at this fog, thinking it could actually be hiding our new life from us. By the way, we should be approaching the bridge soon. Damn it! A campfire! People! There are people there! Hit the brakes! Ah, oh, crap! Ah! We crush at least two people. All right, well, that's uh, right. Four bogies on a trolley. All right, where? Hello? Report for the bridge on the double. I would really like a sniper rifle. Okay. Uh, are we calling this the bridge? Are you all right, Artyom? How bad is it? Can we move? No, we're stuck! Oh, shit. Damn fog. Seems we ran through someone's roadblock. Who was it? Any uniforms? None. They were wearing rags. Just some old farts. Old farts? Huh? That's just the perimeter guard. They could put anyone there, even women and children. Do you really think we found them, Colonel? Well, we can't be sure. I was expecting to run into them much earlier. The trolley is headed towards the bridge. Some fortifications there. This looks peaceful. The village and a church on the water. We need intel. Here, Artyom. I put a mark on your map. Okay. Get there and find out what you can about that bridge. And taking a prisoner would be ideal. Anna, you cover him. Yes, sir. May I go with Artyom too? As backup? No. Until we figure out our situation, you are not to take a step away from the Aurora. These two can handle themselves just fine. Okay. So we yeah. get these big maps now. Right. Let's go, Artyom. I see. Get to it then. Uh, how do I get out of here? Oh, okay, here we go. Spartans, let's prepare the Aurora for defensive action. A horde modes. Don't forget your backpack. It's a new model. Woo! Portable workshop, so to speak. The manual is inside. Nice. Yes, sir. Thank you, Tucker. Yes, sir. It doesn't come with crafting materials, though, so keep an eye out for those. Okay. Let's move out, Artyom. Okay. Just be careful out there. We'll do, buddy. Let's sure go, honey. Thing. I gotta say, that was one flimsy roadblock. And those guys, well, they didn't look like army men at all. Just old men. Be careful out there. Remember, most of the country has been destroyed or occupied. Even those who speak our language might be enemies, by conviction or out of fear. Got it? Do you Take me to church. We must have given them a good scare. Maybe they served the enemy and slaves. Going down. All right. Ah, that was great. I need a sniper rifle. So how do I workshop? Hey, what was that? Did you check it out? Okay. Flashlight. Why would I get myself away with a flashlight? Oh, materials! So oh, this crafting now, huh? Full on. Somebody about to get shot up in here. I. Let's see. So L or oh no, it's got to be I. Hold on. We can craft now. That's cool. 
I can make med kits, gas mask filters, throwing knife, decoy. Okay, cool, cool. Good. Throwing knives are going to be important if I want to be silent. I'm not a doof. Didn't find anything. Hey, Atyom, what's taking you so long? Come outside. Found nothing. I took a look around while you were inside. Uh huh. That electric tower there looks like a perfect sniping position. Let's go. Yeah, okay. I assume we're going to need our masks eventually. And our filters. I'm questioning when, though. It might be nuclear zones. Oh, you can save your progress and quick save? Okay. Yeah, we're not necessarily open world, but we're in big maps now, for now. We gotta do stuff out here, and then we come back to the train and move on. Okay, so that's how they're handling it. Alright, cool. Look, a rabbit. Missed! <laughs> Am I supposed to shoot it or not? Well, people know we're here now, because I did that. Besides the train, I guess. There's stuff in there. <laughs> Dead body. Key kettle. Kettle's not a thing? Alright. Yeah. There's a boat at the dock. Get over here when you're done. Okay. I saw something glowy, so I'm looking for that. Going in? Yeah, we're exploring now. Okay, it's open world-ish. It's like it's not necessarily. It's like they're giving you good-sized maps to explore around, basically. So that's cool. Dead buddy. Can I pick these? Yes, I can. Okay. All right. I assume we're going to find, like, I think I already said, like, uh, nuclear aided. <laughs> I say that word. Uh, pockets. My stuff. Damn it! Ugh. I got to stop hitting C as crouch. Ugh. Does that count as meat? Nope, you can't eat it. Okay. Is that her or someone else? That's a girl. Okay. Rats. Okay. Check out more boating. Explore as much as you can because who knows how hard it's going to be, I guess. Like, I have no clue. Wait. Oh! Oh, take it back. Let's see, what kind of weapon is this? What was that R thing about? Hmm. Unless, let me see here. Oh, I can add it to this gun. Sweet, do it. Right? No, I couldn't. I took the modifications off, so I'm gonna go back. Let me see, can I put the modifications on this weapon? I can, alright. There we go. That's cool, because there were little modifications. I don't know what's the better weapon, this one or the other one, right? Okay, let's see here. So let's take a look here. Oh god, I have to look, I have to do this to look at my weapon. So it's got a damage of seven. Accuracy, stability. Okay, so damage of seven. What about this one. So I gotta do my backpack to check it. Okay, good to know. This weapon's got a damage of two. 
So this is not a better weapon. Alright, good to keep in mind. Okay. So we still have the better weapon. Yeah, these parts. So I messed up. <laughs> uh, Alright, good to know. Fix my gun up. Get the suppressor. Reflex. Got my other gun. Oh wow, that gun's the stronger weapon, huh? Okay. Oh, this pistol's the stronger one. Alright. Get out. Go see what a girl wants. Okay, Artyom. I'll climb up there while you take the boat to the church. Okay. I'll call you when I'm settled. Alright. Break a leg. I don't wanna. Can I not shoot while I'm up here? I guess I can't. Boating. Crab monsters! Oh crap! Oh, I just gotta go through. I remember these things. Junk, yeah? Yeah, do you see these things, honey? Do, do you see them? Because I'm concerned. I am very concerned. Those are not seals. Oh, that's a bad sign. Slap the crow. Ooh. Uh, looks like it's been Duh. Okay. I see people at the church. None seem to be armed. We'd better try the open approach. Let's not fire first, okay? <laughs> no dice. A radio? Kill them. Kill them. I feel like this is about we to be a ride. A lot, so please keep your weapons shield. I feel like I'm about to be on a Disney trip. Alright. Guess my. Alright. Oh god, I'm stuck. There we go. Hey, this is boy. Oh, that's a little girl. Hey, this is girl. Okay, Nastya. They killed my friends and my daddy. Can I get out of this thing? Balls! 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 How do I sheath this weapon? It's not holstering. We're not from here either. Silantius left us up here a year ago. Yes, the bridge dwellers won't even talk to heretics. Okay. But I'll tell you everything I've seen in this place all that year. Uh, it's the bridge guard. Silantius fooled them just like the locals. But unlike them, the bridge guard have guns. Okay, what am I gonna do? There's a way out down here and there's a boat at the dock. Okay. We also have one. It's the small for all of us. Okay. Paladin. Hi. Give me your parts. I got it. Whoop. No, I'm still gonna save you later, girls. Deal with this. I have no idea that's a good weapon. Uh -huh. 
Okay. Getting to work. Mm, probably not a better weapon. Don't forget the craft ammunition and survival. Oh, all right. How do I do that? How do I do that, game? Weapons. Put the butt on. Ooh, make it even better. Yeah, less accuracy, but more stable. Okay, other gun. All right, no grips on that. Okay, whoops. Okay, we can't save. Okay. All right, time to kill more people. They want me to take a bow, but I'm going to just keep killing people. That's kind of what I do. I'm kind of a killer. Uh oh. I can't drag bodies, can I? Crap. Yeah, yeah. I got it, baby. I got it. But I missed that shot. I'll pause. Really? This is what suppression's for. No, I'm not. No, you don't. Shite. All right, okay. All right. No more sneaking. Yeah, yeah, that's where I am. Yeah, totally I'm over there. I'm totally over there. I'm not over here. I'm over there. Ooh. Hi! Got that. Uh, you have any parts I want? Yeah, okay. I need to walk up and punch those guys. I gotta go punch these guys so they don't bother me. Uh, anything I can loot? Nope. Good play. Okay. You are now spared. Dunk. There you go. Yeah, there we go. Take the ammo out of that weapon. I need to go spare this other guy. Time to spare you. There you go. Alright, you're spared. You are now spared. Okay, give me your ammo. Thank you. I'm gonna take that. Chick chickens? Oh, rabbits! They got rabbits. Okay, that's cool. I guess we're done here. Okay. From one engaging to another, gonna wash my hands. Doo -doo -doo. So th those were guards, though, right? Like these guys don't have weapons, but the guards do. Uh, trying to okay, how do I get out of here? Map. Okay. There were stairs. There they are. These rabbits keep giving me away. I thought <laughs> freaking freaking rabbits. Doors open. Oh, what's going on? Oh, I don't feel right. Uh -huh. Oh my god! I went the wrong way. I don't know what that was about. Apparently, these guys are not actually really great. Wait, can I just... No, I can only switch. I can't carry extra weapons. How do I get out of here? I went here, and then... Alright. Okay. Ladder! Here we go. Probably should have listened to the other people, because I have no idea where I'm going. Okay, this is where the kids are. Uh, I'm lost. But I got things, so that works. Oh down. Okay. Um, I'm kind of lost here. Oh yeah, she told me to get to a boat. 
Where is there a boat? Out here? Oh yeah, that boat. We saw this boat coming in. I gotta end really quick. He has to give us away. Oh, I didn't mean to. Oops. Yeah, that right there was that was a bad guy move right there. I did not mean to do a bad guy move like that. Oops. Yeah, it's that sound that made me think he was shooting at me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me knock you out. Sparing you. Taking your stuff, though. Yeah, I killed a surrendering guy. That was a mistake. My bad. I mean, I need to switch that. I need Because I meant to... Ugh. Switch it to cans. So I stopped murdering innocent people. Oh, yeah. Murdering those people is going to affect whatever the ending is. The good or bad ending. It's always like that. If you want to have a good ending, you need to be a good guy. I don't know what I... Oh, I gotta come over here. I don't know what I need to do to be a good guy, though, but I already screwed up and did a bad guy thing. Yeah, if I didn't keep looking around, I could have skipped killing that guy. Also, I just got him in the arm with a knife. Come on! I should have killed him. Right in the arm. It's not deadly. Ah, let's get going. Boat. Does that mean I can save? Nope. Oh, no, no, no. Oars! Boat out of here. Where am I boating to? I'm getting more negative. I'm getting negative karma because I'm just murdering too many people. All right, so I can't just kill everyone. Lesson learned. Kill everyone anyway. All right. Well, karma lessons. Karma lessons. Shit! 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 Hey, how's it going? Shoot, back to back to fudge. Get the fudge. There you go. Yeah, I need you to get the hell off my boat. Yeah, I need you to get the hell off my boat. I wonder if killing a rabbit would have ruined my uh, my karma too. Who knows? Let's go. Artyom, over here. I'm coming slowly. Oh, son of a! I can never. Oh, Jesus! Okay. All right. Dude, get your gun out. Dude, get your gun out. Not this. Oh, there goes my boat. I can swim, right? This isn't GTA, right? I can swim. Oh, God. Oh. Wow, we swam far. Woo. What the fuck was that? A whale? It's fucking huge! Yeah! Let us never deal with that. The old man sent me out as a forward sentry. Told me that I was to sit tight and under no circumstances look for any action. <laughs> so I just had a front row seat watching you there. And holy shit, you did not disappoint. <laughs> Anna has already reported on the cult. <sighs> How about we trade places? I'd hate to come back to Moscow without even firing once. I was trying to win a girl over from one trader. Tough luck there. Why does everybody else get fun missions? The colonel does criticize you and all, but he gives you all the best action. Is this his way of showing affection or trying to get you killed? You think? But I have to say it's unfair. I've been dragged out of Moscow and for what? Stalking the furnace and sitting in a bog with a dumb spyglass. 
Here, though, we do have a chance of finding some loot. Oh. There is this plane there. Just leave something for me. I'll have to stay longer, I suspect. Are you something for you? All right. The shrimps are giving me trouble, though. Ah, uh, he's still talking. I uh, wish I fine. could somehow talk fine. to that catfish into jumping all those water bugs. How did Mowgli talk to the animals, I wonder? We can jungle book. Uh, okay. Speaking of Mowgli, uh. we have the same blood type, you and I. Haven't you noticed? <laughs> well, I guess you have to go now, Artyom. I feel your father-in-law training his binoculars on us to turn us into pillars of salt. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right, okay. <laughs> to the plane. All right, okay, so that'll be it for now. All right. So, that's saved? That's it. So, next time we're going to go check out the plane. The Got it. Okay, let's see. Does that give you anything? Get my journal. Please tell me this gives me something. I'm not killing needless. No, no, I'm an asshole. Okay, well, now we know. Now we know. I'm just... It's all spread out, too. Jesus. All right, so... That's the game for now. Next time we'll check out the plane. Thanks for coming by. See you next time in Metro Exodus. This could be a lot of fun. I'm really interested.